the band upright row, a great option if you don't have a good variety of dumbbells to use that motion, or if you want to cut out some of that momentum we often get into, that constant tension of the band is going to be a great way to add an extra stimulus to that cap of the shoulder, a little bit of the back of the shoulder, and into those traps. So you're going to set it up by placing the band on the ground, standing on it, and then you're going to go with a crisscross. That's the pro tip. Okay. Now to increase the difficulty, you can simply widen your stance on the band or go to a heavier band. Then from here you're cueing it the same way you did with your dumbbells. We're thinking elbows are driving outward and the hands are pulling to that nose height. You'll see that I'm not restricting my shoulders back together where they don't want to move. I'm going to let those elbows go out, I'm going to let those shoulders glide up, and the hands are going to follow so that the hands and the elbows end up about the same height. If done correctly, you get a little bit of that pulling apart feeling to get that upper back turned on and that upward motion to hit that top of the cap of the shoulder and those traps.